Choose Wiser hopes to empower women to become vigilant consumers, to enlighten one woman at a time and witness that light cast onto our children's generation. Robin Organ is an inspirational woman creating change in our schools. She founded Green Schools, a nonprofit organization in 2007. Our mission is to create greener and healthier learning environments through education and awareness. Our primary goal is to create healthy bodies and a healthy planet. And we focus all of our programming on indoor air quality, green cleaning, nutrition, uh, and the three R's, reduce, reuse, recycle. We've been literally getting calls from across the state of Massachusetts, uh, across the country, and now reaching other countries. Um, Facebook and some of the newer technologies, the word is spreading. I uh, just got an email from Malaysia the other day, wow. um, Africa, India. When you go into schools, what do you focus on? We've moved schools over to green cleaning programs or even a greener cleaning program. They may have implemented a start to a program and then we've worked with changing over paper towels and just keep you know, moving along the, the green curve. Uh, green cleaning is when you have safer cleaning chemicals uh, or materials that can clean without the ammonia, bleach, or harsh chemicals that put in, go into the air. And then there are hundreds of products out there that are EPA, Green Seal approved, that are just better choices for the school environment and your home. So in some schools, they might have pretty serious indoor air quality issues um, that go beyond cleaning chemicals and things like that in the classroom. We can address that very quickly. However, we have partners like the EPA and Department of Public Health who have gone in and done audits for us to help make those schools healthy schools. Green schools doesn't push or preach, we just share education. What is one thing that we could do today to make a difference? It doesn't matter if it's starting with a policy change, starting with training the staff, um, doing community education sessions so that the parents understand how they can support the school or even getting the kids excited. Once those kids are excited, programs literally fall into place. Um, Many of our students are the ones that maintain the composting projects, they do the recycling programs, they do educational fairs, they've come up with green fashion shows. If you can get the kids involved, if you can get everyone involved, but start in one place and then just trust the process. The process will happen um, and just find the positive energy in that school and, and see how we can help. When I talked about green cleaning products, schools literally open up their cabinets and show us what they have and say, should we be using this? They need help, their guards are down, and you know they look to us as a friend and a friendly resource. Is there something that really stands out? Each one of us has an immune system, and our goal is to keep our immune system intact. And if you think about it, your immune system as a bucket, um, we start to see symptoms when that bucket overflows. So again, if for somebody like me, what might fill my bucket could be the yellow dyes that I talked about, could be chemicals in the air, could be makeup, could be toxic food, and that's when you start seeing symptoms. Um, we've also taken that analogy out. If somebody has diabetes, you know, what fills up their immune system faster? Well, we know sugar and other types of things would make that bucket overflow, and that analogy works really well um, with a number of diseases or illnesses, and again, our goal when you start taking those pieces out, letting the immune system work, um, those symptoms literally disappear. Two of the tools she uses to excite the children include a hip-hop rock band with custom songs and a character named Green Girl. Uh, Green Girl is our mascot or, or character that teaches kids about sustainability and also about how to be green. Um, she's visited preschools and elementary schools and she teaches kids how to incorporate green and sustainable practices into their everyday life and also into the school. I mean, when you see kids and you ask them, you know, what can they do to help the earth? What can they do to help the environment? They know the, the younger kids are already being raised where they know how to do this. You know, it's the burden that was placed on them. They inherited all these problems and they have to fix it. And, and kids is where it's got to start. Choose wiser.